What's going on everybody? Thank you so much for joining me today. As you can see, we're just coming up to our sky bridge and that is right. You guessed it. We're going to fight a mechanical boss today. And here we are ready to go. I've got everything set up. All my potions are here. I've got the mechanical eye ready. So let's do this. I'm excited to beat this son of a gun. Let's do it. My strategy is going to be take out the green guy first, just focus on him, get him down, and then we'll focus on the red guy after that. Pretty straightforward. Oh, get out of the way, Mr. Red. I'm trying to take on your twin brother there. They are much easier to fight if you kill one first and then focus on the other. Don't get them both down, just focus one, kill it, then get the second one. I will even stop shooting if I have to, to avoid damaging the red one too much. Alright, now the sky bridge is in full effect right now. It is ready to go, except for this part. <laughs> I do need to switch occasionally to keep myself on the asphalt. Um, that end doesn't isn't quite finished. I, don't have a, I ran out of rock, but uh, to the right here, this side, it goes all the way to the edge of the map, all the way to the ocean. So we should be good in this direction for a little while. And as you can see, the speed bonus we get from this asphalt is pretty huge. It's almost equivalent to uh, riding a mount, maybe even faster. Alright, so Mr. Green is down to his second phase. And he's going to start slowing down significantly and then speeding up significantly. So i got to watch him. He slows down and then he's going to chase us real fast. Alright, then he chases. And he slows, oh, oh, crap. And he slows down. Very nice. Oop, okay. And he speeds up. <laughs> I gotta pay a little closer attention. Where's he at? We're getting him. We're getting him. There he is. Alright, let's switch. I'm going to take this guy back towards the middle, and then we'll probably switch again and head back direction. Just try and avoid switching as much as possible. Sometimes you can get into sticky situations when you try and flip directions. And this guy's so slow, I'm worried about him despawning on me. So I don't even have to... I don't even have to sweat flip him. We can just treat him like Skeletor over here. Just go back and forth. Ah! Wouldn't for the zombies, we'd be perfectly fine. He is a little bit easier to damage, though, if we just lead him in one direction. Uh, this is going to be good. If we get these guys down, uh, we'll be able to make our hollow set for sure. Because I have the chest piece and the legs. The only thing we're short on is the helmet. So we will be able to get our next progression going. Our next stage in the uh, armor progression after this fight. Oh, here we go. Second phase. Let's really focus this guy down. It's his... Uh, his lasers get pretty nasty here. Should have tried to uh, build a better set of wings. I have a bat. The bat part, or the bat wing that I can use, but I forgot. Sorry, it's like the one thing I didn't do. I even went and reforged my bow and everything. Oh, great. You gotta be kidding me. Come here, you stupid sky dragon. You're not getting away. You're not getting away from me. I'll save my arrows for this guy. Guys, that was so easy. I think we might actually try and do that fight again. Let me go home just to see what time it is. Because if it's a little too late, I don't want to waste a summoning item. But I do have a second one right there. So what time is it? 1 a.m.? Three hours to go three and a half ish i don't think so i'm not gonna risk it guys like i said i want to waste it we'll just do it again tomorrow night but i will i do plan on farming these bosses um to get as many hollowed bars as i can <laughs> uh but we now we just have to take down the mechanical skeletron guy so maybe we'll go ahead and craft up his little summing device and get that ready for tomorrow night what do you say let's go ahead and open this bag up though Ooh, solar sight we got the other mechanical uh minecart piece Put that away. There we go. 
Yes, very nice. Very, very nice. Okay, let's put that away and I'm gonna grab those bars. Oh, I hope that's enough for a headpiece right there. 25? I don't know. Let's see. Oh, it is. Awesome. So, I'm most likely, yeah, I'm gonna go with melee. Um, just because of the defense bonus it gives me. Now, you'll see, like, with that fight, I used an arrow. You know, so I'm not necessarily going to build a ranged helmet 2 and switch or anything. I just like to hide defense. So let me double check here. One defense, minions. Uh, this is magic. This is ranged. Yep, we're going to go for the 24 defense here. That's pretty huge. All right, we got 13 bars left over. We can make the Excalibur. I think I'm going to do that because it is like almost double the damage of my Nasty Knight's Edge here. Oh, look at this. It's almost, it's got a very similar type effect to the Knight's Edge too. Cool. All right, um, let's put the Knight's Edge away because we're definitely keeping that. We'll be using that a little bit later on. We got one hallowed bar left. Let's drop that in the chest. And then we are gonna don our new set of armor, folks. Uh, I need another mannequin too. I don't think I have any wood on me. Yeah, I'm gonna keep all these pieces of gear I'm keeping those, so we need another mannequin. There we go. Put it right here. Eventually I'm going to set up like a little museum or display slash room over here. Actually, I might go ahead and take out these bedrooms once we get rid of all the people. I'm pretty sure, yeah, the nurse is the only person left here anyway, so we could change all this out. Eventually I'll do that. Um, I might have gone a little bit overboard with my teleporters too, but I wanted to have enough, you know. Only one's actually hooked up right now, but the rest of them we'll, we'll work on getting those connected at some point in the future too. So for right now, let me empty out my bags and we'll do something fun. We'll have another little adventure or something. Find another boss for sure. Put that away. Okay. Oh, let's see what we can craft up with our soul of sight. I think actually I might be able to get a better summoning item. So let me check that out this wood away where's my craft here? okay Ooh. true knight's edge now what do we need for that okay we need 20 of each all right all right we're getting there the drax we also need uh, to kill the uh, skeleton now this though we don't oh we need more hollow bars shoot that's okay um, these we can't do without the Soul of Fright. This we could probably make, but I'm not really going to use the Rainbow Rod. I'll plan on it. Yep, need the Soul of Fright for that too. Alright, so there's not really much we can do with these. What does this do? Huh. Probably just... <laughs> a really really expensive light all right we'll just save those put them away for now not much to do gosh we should probably go get some more solar knights huh we might need them at some point yeah that farm we got down below there is a very lucrative little farm too uh before we do that let me go ahead and craft up some of the summoning items i don't want to wait till the last minute to craft these up that's not a good idea so i know i need that we might actually need some Soul of Night to craft these. Let me see. Oh, mechanical Skull. Yeah, I need a, I need three Souls of Night, which we actually have, but we only got four total, so. And Bones. B -b bones. We got plenty of Bones. So I'm going to stick those in here. I'll put that metal in there, too. All right, we can craft one. Am I crazy? Why am I not seeing it? There's the fairy wings. Oh, no, I don't want to make those. Uh, I do want to make the bat wing, though. I think that's probably better than the demon wings I'm wearing. I'm not 100%, but I'll look that up. Um, let me find this silly mechanical skull. Why am I not seeing it here? I thought I had everything I needed. Oh, wait, where'd our soul of lights go? Wait, what? Nope, wrong chest. Haha! That's the culprit. 
There we go. Alright, so we got the little summoning device ready. I'll stick that eyeball in here. This guy, in my opinion, is the toughest of the mechanical bosses. You know, everybody else probably has their opinion, own opinions, but just for me, he's the tougher one. Uh, not unbeatable, though, by any means. So, let's get ourselves prepared. You know what I really like, though, is another archery potion. Those are really helpful. I don't know exactly what the materials are so let's check that out basically gonna spend most of this day just getting prepared for the battle tonight you know if we really want to have the best opportunity okay what do we need here oh lens oh that's easy we got plenty of lenses I think I might have put them in the hard mode box there we go Let's just split the stack. Put half of them in that other box. Yeah, that's, that's good. Awesome. I thought it was going to be some exotic uh, material I wouldn't... I'd have to go search for or something. Perfect. Okay, so let me... I'm going to go check the bat wing and see which one's better. Just because I don't... Or the fairy wings. Uh, I don't want to waste my soul of flights just now. So I'll be right back, guys. Okay, well, as I suspected, the bat wings seem to be the best out of my options right now. So that's what I'll craft up and replace these. We'll probably go down there and get them reforged too. Uh, hard mode, there we go. All right, let's do the bat wing. Place that. Uh, oh, I guess I got an extra one. Yeah, there we are. Uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and keep these wings. Why not? Stick them over here. Gosh, my box is... My equipment box is getting real full. I have to start selling some of this junk off. Anyway, let's go get this reforged before I forget. I don't want to destack that. Okay. Reforge, please. I might reforge this Excalibur too, just once or twice. Nothing crazy. I'm not like going for. Oh, I was just going to say, I'm not going for legendary, but. <laughs> Guess what? We weren't going for it, but we got it. Nice. Legendary Excalibur, folks. Does that mean we're King Arthur? I think it does. Woohoo! That literally doubled our melee damage from that nasty Knight's Edge that we were just working with. That was like a 50-something. So we've literally doubled our melee. <laughs> okay. Um, anyway, what the hell did I come here for? <laughs> Reforge. Uh, we got these wings here. Maybe I can get a warding set first try, huh? Nope. Yeah. I've got eight uh, platinum. Let's see how much I have to spend to get warding here. Because I do feel like I'll probably be using these bat wings for a while. And it's it's worth it to spend a bit of gold here to get warding. But I don't want to go broke. These are expensive. Oh my god. Alright, next one that I get is defense. I'm going to stick with it. Of course I get the one. Uh because eventually I will be upgrading these to a better set of wings, so it's not like super important that I get the best, but eh, whatever. Same with the boots. Like These are going to get changed eventually, so I don't want to go all out. But everything else that I'm keeping, I'm, I'm trying to get a four defense level. I've got a three here on the yo-yo bag, which kind of sucks, but it's expensive too to reforge, so I'm not doing that. I think we're good enough. Accessories are good. Weapons are good. I've got the Unreal Marrow. So that's, that's again, that's kind of an expensive one. I'm happy with that. What does this one cost? Oh, yeah, I'll take it. All right, better. Better, better. Let's, uh, let's go to the surface. Oh, I should have sold that crap. Damn it. Hold on. See, the problem with getting rid of all my NPCs is I have nobody to sell my junk to anymore. I have to go traveling to find a merchant. Okay, I haven't used the Rubble Maker yet. I have not much reason to, but I might at some point. So that'll be cool. I know that's one of the big featured items for this update. Alright. Okay. So, oh, look at that. Somebody dropped a Nimbus Staff out here. What is the modifier on it? Intense. 10% damage. Yeah, we'll take that one instead. So let me go put this away. Um... Guys, I will go ahead and cut the rest of this day out, and I'll bring you back as soon as it's time to fight the boss, I think. Because I'm just going to continue to try and tweak the rest of my gear and see what I can get squeezed out of it in terms of power and defense. And I'll be right back. 
Okay, guys, it is 7 p.m. It's time to get up top. I hope you're not nervous, because I'm certainly not nervous. No, not at all. Let's do this. I'm trying to kill uh, two mechanical bosses in one episode. Ah, there's nothing to be nervous about. We still got our stars on, so that's good. I haven't worked on the bridge at all. I just spent time doing some potions and whatnot. I think... I think we're ready though, so let me go ahead and pop my potions. Let's do it! I might be a little bit quieter during this fight just because I'm trying to concentrate more. Like I said in previous times, this is my least confident fight. So far I've been scratched. <laughs> Oh, watch out for the bombs. As I recall, with this one, you can start shooting the head right away. You don't have to go for the arms. It's just that it, it, I think by the end, you do end up killing a couple arms, typically, though. I don't know, this bow is so danged accurate. It shoots so fast. You almost can't help but hit the target you're aiming at, as long as your aim is true. It's going to get to its target. God damn it. Stupid enemy on the bridge. I need to look into getting some of those like uh, potions that reduce enemy spawn rates. I should definitely be using those. Come here, you punk. Got about, about a third of the way. See how well this asphalt works against these guys? Let's bring it back this direction. God damn, he does not want me to go in that way. Whew. Man, I am just having the hardest time going to the right here. Look at my health. Got eight seconds on my health potion. Oh, hearts. <gasps> oh, thank God for the heart statues. Like a breath of fresh air. We got another one right here, too. Boom. See how clutch those heart statues are? Really, just truly the best. Halfway. It's going to be a long fight because we don't have like a super tremendous amount of damage output. Plus, I'm missing probably about half my shots. So, I got to really make sure like we don't run out of time with this fight basically don't think oh my god I was, gonna, I was just about to say I don't think he's gonna kill me kill me but he might run the time out and of course then he just mobs me where'd you go buddy down on the asphalt come on oh my god Oh my goodness. I don't think we've even destroyed one of his arms. I'm used to fighting them with uh, less precise weaponry. Come on, boy. Do not go despawning on me, sir. 6,000 health. Come on. Twenty-five Let's do it. Oh, God. Not despawn. Get over here, 300 health. Where's he at? Come here. Yes. All right. What time is it? Can we do that again? The jungle grows restless. Woohoo! Progression, folks. That's progression. All right. What time is it? 12 a.m. We can do it again. Yes. Let's do it again. Um, I got four minutes. I'll try and keep an eye on my potions, but I'm just gonna spawn. Them. We got plenty of arrows. Where is he at? There he is. Come here, you. 
Jesus, what a dumb dumb. I think I'm all Mr. Fancy Pants over here. Almost get murdered. Going back, going back towards the hearts. I want to stay kind of in range of those heart statues. Where'd you go, duty? Come on, duty breath. I keep talking about changing out these platforms. I need to. Because it's kind of throwing me off having to slow down over those platforms. Eh? Alright, back towards the heart statues, my friend. Come on. I hear you freaking out over there. Got about a third of his life down. If I can jump over those platforms, it's not too bad. Alright, let's leave those hearts. Let those develop. I'll try and keep them here, right between the heart statues. Come here. Get out of the clouds there, buddy. Get your head out of the clouds, literally. I'm trying to kill it. I'm trying to shoot your head. Two minutes on our potions. I will pop another group if I need to. I don't know what time it is. I need to put a couple clocks up here, don't I? Or at least make a clock and just keep it in my inventory. Yep, trying to conserve those hearts. I really don't need... Well, I'm not needing them now. I should focus on damage output because if we're not careful... He's going to despawn on me. Half health. He's not too bad. He's not too bad. He's just a big bully. Yeah, this marrow, the the, the bow that I'm using called, using called marrow, whew, super fantastic. Get your hands on this, guys. It's nice. I got it from that... Um, Solar Eclipse event, I'm pretty sure. I wish I could use my legendary Excalibur on this sucker, but I don't know if Melee would hold up too well against him right now. Maybe we, after we upgrade to like Chlorified Armor or something like that. Feel like we're getting we're cutting it real close on the time. Seems like the it's getting a little bit brighter. We can do it. We can push it. If I die here, it doesn't even matter really. I would just get him dead. It's actually, once he goes into this mode, it's actually a little bit easier just to really focus damage on him. Especially with the asphalt, like he's not gonna catch me, so I can just really force the fire on its face. Come on now. Moments to go, buddy. Moments to go. Oh, as long as there's not something freaking on the bridge behind me when I'm running. Come on, dude. Just die. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Dang it. Uh, my bowels were unplugged. Uh, well, we got him once. Like I said, doesn't really matter that I died. We got him. Oh, shoot. Did I hear that imbue last through death? Wow, I didn't know that. Uh, yeah, you know what? I think I did know that the flasks last through death. Anyway, what a great fight. I can't believe I didn't pull it off there in the end. Oh, well. Oh, look. We got a little robotic. <laughs> Oh, that guy is awesome looking. I, I've mentioned before, I don't even really care for these animals because they get in my way when I'm building, but I might keep this guy. He's cool. <laughs> Look at his spinning head. All right, we're keeping him. Um, got the statue. Don't worry, I'm going to do something with all these statues that I'm just throwing into my chest right now, especially the gold ones. We'll, we'll have those all set up eventually. Um, all right, so let's pop open our bag, see what we got. Minecart, well, 
pretty obvious. Not a big surprise, was it? <laughs> um, we can do the mine cart now, so I guess we'll do that. Why not? And craft that up. Um, what do we need for it? Oh, permanently grants. This is different than I'm used to. Permanently grants boosted speed and defensive probe from. What's a defensive probe for minecarts? Okay, how do I use this? Oh, there we go. Cool. Alright, yeah, we'll switch it with the ladybug. That's fine. Um, put the ladybug away. Boom. Nice. Okay, let's see what we can do here with our uh, metal uh, and, and our new materials that we got. I might need to kill a few more of these mechanical bosses and get some more hallowed bars before we can really start to make everything I want. But let's see, let's see. Dur Durandal. I've never heard of that one. Oh, that gives your... Oh, that's like a summoning item. Nice, nice. It's a summoning weapon. Light disc, no... Do, do, do. Could do the Dalva Pal, but now really what we need to focus on is this. Yep, we need to make the Drax, or I could do the Pickaxe. Let's see, this is 200%. The Drax is 200. Oh, they both have the same axe power, except the Drax just has negative range. This is fast, but you know what? I'm going to go with this because we already have a boost to our speed here. I've got like a super boost with that chisel, so I'm happy with our speed levels. Um, let's let's keep the range going. So where was that? Do 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 pickaxe. Let's do it. Oh yeah, folks. Progression. Like I said, we're getting it done. All right. You know what that means? I'm gonna get out there into the jungle and just mine up a whole bunch of chlorified ore. Or, oh, I've been talking tons, like stacks and stacks of it. Um, maybe we'll do that for an entire episode. How's that sound? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh, what I will do is I will bring you guys in for the next episode. We'll, uh, we'll check out the jungle. We'll explore it a little bit, but we'll do some other exciting stuff. Come back tomorrow. We're going to have a brand new one up. I will see you guys then. Thank you so much for joining me. Take it easy.